Hello and welcome to another video by myself, James Lawson Smith. Today I'm going to be going over some of the new features in the YouTube online video editor. Now to get to this, you just log into your YouTube account, click on my videos, then go along to video editor, or if you want to get there really quickly, I will put a link down below in the description box. Now those of you that know, you can edit your footage online, you just drag your clips down so we'll drag that one and that one or actually no I don't want that one I'll take this one so here we are we got two clips here now they've added some new transition effects so you can just click on transitions which is just up here and you've got crossfade and cross blur which is what they had before but now they have some shape layers you can have a heart a star, a diamond, or a jack-o'-lantern for those Halloween ones. So all you have to do is just take your transition that you want and just drop it in the middle. Now to see what it looks like, you just hit play. And then I'm just going to go along to where it appears, which is about there, I think. Just going to mute the audio there. So there it is. So there we are, we have a heart transition between one clip and another clip. Now, the other new feature that they've added, if we go back to my videos, now when you hover over your video clip that's in the timeline, you get an effects button. So you click on effects, and what they've added here is you can now make your video black and white. So you just click on black and white, and your video magically gets transformed into a black and white video. Now, the really exciting bit is they've added stabilize video. Now, as you can see in this video, I'll just let it play. It's quite shaky and, you know, moving about because I was just walking about with my phone. So I'm just going to hit stabilize video. And then within a few seconds, it will give you this is sort of a preview of what it will look like. So it stabilized it quite well. Now I, I am going to do another video actually comparing this to the industry standard After Effects. So I'm going to compare the stabilization of YouTube and how After Effects stabilizes the video footage as well. And just compare the two, sort of free versus $1,000. <laughs> um, what you can also do now is you can also adjust your brightness and contrast. We just click on there. So I'll whack the brightness up a little bit and the contrast and see what happens. So there we are, just processing the video now. So there we are, there it is with stabilization enabled. It's in black and white and it's also been brightness and contrast um, corrected as it were. So all the old features are still there, so you can still rotate your video if you need to, and you can still trim your footage. I will be making a full video on all of the features on the video editor. Um, another new feature that a lot of people have been asking for is when you do an audio swap, you can now adjust the volume. So you just drag your, foot, your music that you want, and you get a little volume bar on it. So I can just turn that down. And you can have the audio. Hello and welcome to the first walk and talk update from myself, James Lawson Smith. So you can have music from the audio swap library, but still have your original video. So you can sort of mix the two. Now, I do suggest on a lot of them, you have it all the way turned down just about before it goes to original audio only. Because some of the, a lot of the audio swap library is rather loud. Hello and welcome to the first walk and talk update from myself, James Lawson Smith. So there we so have it. So there we have it. The all the new features in the new video editor. As I said, I'm going to be making a full guide to this uh, in the next sort of week or so. So if you like these sorts of videos, please don't forget to comment down below and uh, please subscribe. I'll be, as I said, I'll be making a full guide to the online video editor and all of the other features of YouTube and all of the announcements that they make. So yet again, please don't forget to comment, rate 
and subscribe and thank you very much for watching.